Hello. Right. Um, I've been a little bit busy lately and I have not been doing tutorials. I'm currently just got home and I'm checking out 5.1. It compiled pretty quickly. It took about uh, 40 minutes on my new machine and it compiled first time. No problems. Um, I'm just checking out the retargeter and this is the new layout so far i mean it'll obviously there's a chance it'll all change uh we have new buttons like uh root settings here and over here we obviously we can now set if we press pause here we can pause and play uh, the retargeting if we uh go to source and go to edit mode there is no draw bone size on here, but if we come up to character, go to bones, it's here. And we can make that a little bit smaller, like so. And I will draw. Now it draws it on both characters, which is also fantastic. But obviously, with source selected, we can now set a pose here, I presume. Let me try it. Yep. So we can perhaps put this in a T pose or or an A pose, whatever. And then obviously, let's just reset that. If we come over to target, it's exactly the same as it was before. We can set a pose here. Also, it's uh, with the cleaned up UI. Let me just see if we can find this. Right, so we can create poses from pose assets, which is fantastic. So now we can just pick a pose. And it will do that. I don't think I've got any though to show you at the moment. No, I haven't got any, so I can't actually show you. Um, we can create from an animation sequence, obviously. So if we go to um, say run, and it's ask us which frame. Let's just zoom into about 38. And we'll call this S pose. And import that, and there you go. With the looks of it, the IK bones are all still broken. Um, I can't see that being fixed anytime soon. But it's fine. Um, obviously, again, we can do this pose on this source. Um, let's create pose from an animation. And let's do it from walk this time. And we'll do it from 38. And we'll do it. Test source pose and import, and there you go. So now we could retarget between these two. Use your imagination. <laughs> um, so let's just reset those. Reset and go to target, reset and run. And there we go. See, the IK bones seem to be retargeting fine here. Um, I'm yet to test on another character. As I said, I've only just started trying this. It's been a while since I've used Unreal Engine 5.1. Um, I've been so busy. Um, but yeah, so that's what we're looking at today. Um, I, I like how the new uh, UI is laid out. Everything seems to be in the right place, except for the draw bone size. I don't know why it's moved up there. Unless I'm missing something here. There are some new options, look. Um, the IK adjustments are still the same. But down here, there is plank, plant IK by speed. Um, I do not know what that is for yet. I'm going to have a practice. Let's have a look. There we go. Yep, yeah, I will look into that. Hopefully there's some documentation somewhere. Um, but that's it. That's just what I want to show you. Um, yep, so there we go. Unreal Engine 5.1. I will do some more content with this. Um, I'm going to build a project out of it this week and see how stable it is. But that's it. Um, everything else seems to be the same in the UI. Yep. 
that's it all right i will get some more content out shortly i just really i've been so busy um away from my workstation so bear with me <laughs>